And then you pass here. The Ovahimba are indigenous people living in Namibia's northern region of Kunene. They are culturally oriented and to their traditional ways have put them on the world center stage. This ethnic group practices early arranged marriages and this happens from the onset of puberty. I'm against the early child marriages. I was also forced to get married at a young age, but I refused. 35-year-old Kashiaruka Muharuka ran away from problems like child marriages and poverty in Opuo to search for greener pastures in Swakopmund. She is one of the Ovahimba women selling handmade jewelry on the streets. The market is, however, a problem. John Shambiru, an unemployed Himba man from Opuo, knows the struggle. He established an Ovahimba village to create jobs and a central point where business is done professionally. I just wanted to encourage them because there is no other way. We don't have a better qualification, education to look for work. I think they must come and join me to promote our cultures because the tourists, they were not coming to visit the sea or other business, I mean other things. They will come to see how is our tradition in Namibia is. Visitors to the cultural village will be exposed to the Ovahimba culture. The women and men will show tourists, among others, how the Ovahimbas create their hearts, jewelry, cosmetics and medicine. The Ovahimba village, located next to Martin Luther Museum, received help from the Irungu governor Cleophas Mushavikwa. Mushavikwa revealed in the past that three other traditional cultural villages are planned for Swakopmund to provide a unique opportunity to experience cultures and customs of the local tribes. The coastal town of Swakopmund is a major draw card for tourists from all over the world. From showcasing its German origins through architecture to skydiving, tourism is actually the backbone of this town's economy. And the latest addition of this Ovahimba traditional village is creating diversity needed to boost the sector. Renate Rengura, NBC News, Swakopmund.